Hello, my name is Kawala. I am a political leader from Cameroon and an entrepreneur. Um, I am a member of the Cameroonian opposition. We are doing our best to bring democracy to Cameroon, um, which we think is going to happen very, very soon, uh, and uh, to enable our country actually um, achieve its potential. Technology is very important for us uh, right now in, in, in Cameroon and I would say in Africa as a whole. One is that it's giving the opportunity to groups who do not have access because they are not part of the power structure. So that means young people, that means uh, women, that means people with disabilities, um, ethnic minorities, all have the possibility to create their own voice. Um, I think that this is extraordinary. We're seeing it playing a very important role in political campaigns. And even though internet penetration is still very, very low in most of Sub-Saharan Africa, it's 10% or less, but still um, the people who are on the internet are innov innovators, they're thought leaders. So they are taking the information from the internet back to their communities, back to their groups of friends, families, um, and so on and so forth. So in, in countries like mine, where the state has a heavy hand on the media, and um, even though it is relatively free, the hand of the state can come down at any moment, um, whenever they don't like whatever message is being put forth. Um, the, the internet and, and technology as a whole, even uh, mobile phones, give us the opportunity to get our own message out. We're really seeing products from, you know, Congo, South Africa, Kenya, as you've mentioned, um, with young African innovators. Cameroonians are very, very involved um, as developers and actually are subcontracting for their colleagues throughout the continent and uh, even in Western countries. Um, so I believe there's an extraordinary potential for technology in Cameroon and that one of the things that we need to do politically is to build the infrastructure because um, we have to keep in mind that in Africa we, are, we still have a problem of basic infrastructure, access to the internet, broadband cables, um, being able to actually get some form of computer or the other into the hands of, of Africans, you know. Um, I think that with the spirit of creativity that we have, um, just putting the technology in the hands of people uh, is going to enable us to, to really reveal extraordinary things. I think that for us as Africans, we are looking at how do we, um, you know, make a gigantic leap and close the gap that is between us and the rest of the world. And of course, we are looking at this technology to solve practical problems. How does technology enable us to increase access to water? How does it enable us to increase access to health care? Um, how do we fast track education using technology? So for us as a continent, it's really about um, technology as a tool to help us close the development gap.